My name is Eliezer Ben Yehuda. I'm rabbi at Bethel Beach Synagogue in Panavidu Beach. Uh, and I'm originally uh, from uh, Jerusalem, uh, Israel. I was born in Israel and I lived in Israel uh, for a number of years under the British uh, rule, British mandate. And I was there uh, when the United Nations voted on the creation of uh, the partition of uh, British Mandatory Palestine into a Jewish and a, an Arab uh, states. That was in uh, November of 1947, and then I was there, of course, in 1948, when the uh, uh, state came into being on the 14th of May. Um, I uh, was asked if I had uh, actually heard the radio broadcast of the uh, um, uh, announcement of the uh, Declaration of Independence, and uh, I did not because Jer I was in Jerusalem and Jerusalem was under siege. Uh, my family actually was one of the uh, uh, family of the founding fathers of uh, the new state. Um, my grandfather, uh, for whom I'm named, Eliezer Ben Yehuda. Uh, there are Ben Yehuda streets, Eliezer Ben Yehuda streets, uh, in every major city in Israel. One of the things that uh, I remember so well, before the creation of the state, uh, between the 29th of November, when the UN decided on uh, creating the Arab and the Jewish state, and the 14th of May, when actually the state of Israel came into being, uh, there were uh, many acts of terror. Uh, some of them we have become used to and we are familiar with today because of the uh, uh, war in Iraq. Uh, one of the uh, terrible things that happened during that period was there were three, there were three um, uh, pickup trucks and they were full of uh, uh, explosives and they blew up and uh, 12 buildings were either destroyed or badly damaged so that they had to be torn down. And uh, 57 people were killed and more than 100 other people were uh, hurt, wounded, maimed, etc. So uh, that was an event that uh, became known as the Ben Yehuda Street uh, explosion. And, uh, you know, the name Ben Yehuda has been in the uh, news a number of times since then because, unfortunately, there were other terrorist attacks uh, since then, and Ben Yehuda is one of the main streets in downtown Jerusalem, and so, you know, that's uh, a connection and not a very good connection. The State of Israel came into being uh, in, in, in the middle of a war, uh, which I must say that we who lived through it, uh, the young people who were the soldiers, you know, and the elder, older people who were uh, you know, the elders of uh, the community. You must remember that in all of Israel there were about 600,000 people at the time. So it was practically like, you know, a global village, you know, one large village. And uh, we were hoping that this was all kind of like the birth pangs and that before very long it's going to be over and Israel will return to normal and will live a uh, peaceful life. Unfortunately, here we are 60 years later and uh, we're still in the birth pangs and we still have not uh, come to a time of peace. But uh, hopefully for the, uh, you know, when we double the 60, you know, on the 120th uh, anniversary, uh, there's going to be a different story.